Hi everyone, Mikey from Mikey Reviews. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the Braun Series 9 9095cc Premium Wet and Dry Shaver, which also comes with the Advanced Clean and Charge Station. The Series 9 is the latest series for the uh, Braun's electric shavers, and this one is the highest, um, shall I say, the flagship model uh, of this series. Um, let's just take a look on the side here. Um, here are a few details about the, the special blades here. So first you've got a hyper lift and cut trimmer. Then we have the direct and cut trimmer. This one here is designed to capture hairs growing in different directions. Then we've got the Optifoil. Um, let's see here, so it says um, two times Optifoil for perfect closeness that lasts longer. Braun's most advanced foil structure. Then we have the Sonic technology. Uh, the Sonic technology with 10,000 micro vibrations per minute reads your face and adapts to the density of your beard. And then finally, the fully flexible shaving system. For a maximum facial adaptability, Braun's unique combination of pivoting shaver head and individually floating cutting elements. So they are the main features of the shaver head. If we turn the box again, uh, there we go. So first of all, we have the multi headlock. It has five adjustable angles for a precise shave. Then it's a skin friendly precision trimmer for perfect mustache and sideburn shaping. Precise LED battery display with hygiene and travel lock indicator. So it's also waterproof up to five meters for full washability. This is also really good as well. Like, you know, if you're, let's just say you've just had a bath and, or you've had, you've got a bath run and you accidentally dropped your shaver in, at least you know it's not going to break. Now I've done this before with probably about two shavers in the past where they haven't been waterproof and they've just been rendered useless. And that's, you know, a lot of money to lose when you accidentally do that. Uh, the other thing as well is it's rechargeable. Always good and it's powered with a lithium ion battery. Uh, full recharge in one hour, or you can do a five minute quick charge for one shave. And the battery lasts for 50 minutes of cordless shaving. And finally, it comes with a premium leather pouch. Okay, so I've actually already unboxed this, so this isn't a true unboxing video. Um, just a little note though, that there was some sticky tape on the sides here that were very discreet. Once you've got that undone, you can then just flip up the box like so. So anyway, I'm gonna show you the box contents. So first thing included is an instruction manual, of course. Pretty much every product comes with one, and it is very handy to have a little look through. And also on the back here, um, it says here to note down when you um, when you first bought it because that way in 18 months time you know this is a reference and you should really replace the head. Secondly is the leather pouch which actually looks really nice. The only thing that I would kind of comment for an improvement would be to have a um, just a little area which you can store the cleaning brush which is also included. So I've had a little pouch, that way it'll just keep it nice and secure um, so you won't have to worry about it flying out when you open it. That's just one criticism that I would recommend. Then we have the clean and charge dock. So you can um, press this button which pops this out. This is for the clean and renew uh, solution. If you were to use this uh, just to say, uh, if you were to clean your razor every single day, this will last about three weeks. Obviously, if you don't clean it every day, then it's going to last a lot longer. And you have the power cable. This is used to either charge the shaver directly, or you can put it into the charge and cleaning docking station. And then we have the 9095cc electric shaver, which looks very smart. Unfortunately though, this really nice chrome finish does get easily fingerprint marked, as you can already see that it does have some smears already. So let's take a look around the shaver. First of all, on the bottom you have the, um, the charging port, if you want to give it a, a quick charge without using the dock. Um, on the front here, you've got the button. With an LED just below that, it will tell you the battery, how full that is, and if it needs cleaning, it will show a water drop. 
Then just above that is just a little bit of extra grip, but it, it's also a slider for the head, which I'll talk about in a second. Um, along with the grip, you've got some on the back, really nice rubber, really, really grippy. And then in the middle of that, you've got this trimmer, which in my experience, isn't actually that good. Um, that's just my opinion. Like when I've used this, it, it hasn't really been satisfactory results. Now the main head, right at the moment it's locked in, but you can see here, it's got a really nice pivoting movement. And this can be locked into place by sliding this down. So as you can see, that's now locked into place. It can be moved whilst it's locked in, but it does take some force. Okay, so the, um, the foils and the other trimmers up here, you can see that they freely move. So as it's going around the contours of your face, this is flexing around really well. So it does make the shaving experience very pleasant indeed. And also the top bit can be taken off very easily just by pressing these in on the sides. And this means that you can give this a quick rinse and also clean this bit as well. As for doing the proper cleaning process with the clean and charge dock, it is very, very easy to use. I'm gonna show you that now. So now I'm gonna show you how to use the clean and charging dock for the Braun Series 9. So first of all, I would recommend, just so you're not moving this around, is to plug in the power cable. There you go, so that's now in. I'll fully plug it in a bit later, but I don't want to tip this upside down with solution in it. Um, and then press this button here to pop the bottom open. There we go. Then you've got your clean and renew solution. You want to open this up. There you go. Now be careful because this stuff is very flammable. So then what you want to do is you want to just insert this underneath. And then push this back down. So if you haven't got a shaving uh, outlet, you will need to get an adapter. There you go. So I'm now about to power this in. And then in to insert your shaver, you want to push it in like this and then pull it back. You will see there you've got everything lighting up and then you just press this on button. The dock goes through a cleaning cycle of roughly three minutes. And then after that, it'll take about 40 minutes of it drying your electric shaver. But once it's complete, you know it's cleaned, charged, lubricated, disinfected, and has dried your electric shaver, which is gonna keep it maintained to the highest of standard. So now that's all shown, is this a good shaver? Yes it is. Apart from this little trimmer here on the back, which does let it down, it's actually a very good product. Now you do need to, um, let's just say you haven't used this type of shaver before, I would recommend looking into the best ways of using it. First of all, you need to shave on your skin at a 90 degree angle. That's a must. Otherwise, it's not going to do the job properly. And also, um, in some areas, you might need to stretch your skin out so it gets tightened a bit. This will make it a lot easier to cut because if you do it wrong, you're going to think that this absolutely sucks. And I know I did at the, uh, at the beginning, but when you get used to it, it actually does a very good job. So would I recommend it? Absolutely. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and I hope this video has helped.